also joining us from San Diego. Is this is where I just stumbled onto it. Under Obama administration, the same holdovers as which is which are most. They're they're still transporting illegal people, intruders, invaders are arrested on commercial flights on your dime. That's that's what she just said. The idea that you can't immediately deport minors back to non-contiguous countries. That's different, What's non however, from relocating them across relocating the country on commercial her. flights, correct? Yeah, that's wrong. It, it is, and, and it actually uh, That's what the Democrats are doing. They are allowing infiltration of foreigners that, uh, in the name of some kind of, uh, uh, that they didn't want to go back uh, to the country I guess we equality? I don't know. There is no name for it, except illegal. for treason. Enrique... <clears throat> wow, this is unbelievable. The way to enforce American immigration wow, law I can't believe that. In other words, Ooh. to me it seems like a magnet. If uh, you tell people, if you get across the border, yeah, we will and then lie about protect your age. you. We will send you to a sponsor. Yeah. Is Enrique there? I just wow. see a truck. Otherwise, Enrique's changed. <laughs> uh, and we'll just send you all <clears> over <throat> the country to various locations, and uh -huh. you'll be able to stay. There he is. And drop them uh, off. So what of that, Enrique? Wow, that's so wrong. I can't believe that. Taxpayer continues to fund the commercial flights for the illegal people. Uh, I don't think you should use the word immigrants or intruders because you're insulting immigrants that are actually sending in applications and obeying the law by waiting in line. saying, I want asylum and you get in like the Border Patrol Union likes to state. If that were happening, then the Border Patrol Union is greatly responsible because they've been promoting that concept to smugglers. Well, Enrique, I'm confused, though. Yeah, I don't know about this. Yeah, the people that do it? have credible fear, that do have a family funding. member, many of them are allowed to go to that family member and stay there until they go to court. Right, they never go to court. Right, Enrique, yeah, the well, fact is they don't. don't you, you're kidding. They're already, yeah, they're already not they're abiding by our laws. They're already breaking our laws. What do you expect? You're kidding me? With these cases, on many occasions, how many, what's the percentage of individuals who've been ordered deported showing up <clears> in their hearings? Go ahead and read really? that. Really? 55%. <laughs> about 55% oh. of the Brandon. people in these cases <laughs> that you're referring well, to. That's, uh, they never found show up. That's a complete angels. lie. They do not it's show up for the deportation on, hearings. News. Brandon, this is a liar here. We're talking to Fox News. Then why you oh, then why you get on the Fox so News, you fucking liar? liar. Why do you want a, a, a network that's filled with liars? Uh, I asked you, hold on a second, Brandon. No, no, no. Yeah, this is Enrique. He's a fucking liar. I asked you a simple question, and you obfuscated and went to another point. We yeah, and then you really start accusing people are liars. How is it? it. Uh, how, oh, how so is full of shit. Enforcing U.S. law. Enrique, you're full of shit. If you cross the border illegally, yeah, you break the law. You will most assuredly, <clears throat> if unless you are a known felon, you will be released. After a short period of time, yeah, it's because of fucking sponsor, Obama holdover, Democrats, rats, 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 sponsor, <clears throat> try to, to your just uh, uh, and on my question puncture was, how holes in my country, comporting with rats, the rule of law. Puncture now you may holes. answer, um, and then Brandon makes will get sense. And borrow in. It's not happening. It's very rare exceptions that that takes place. So it's important that you know that oh. you speak Now you facts. are lying. We'll talk about I can't believe what so he's border Forget angels mean, meaning that he is a turncoat okay, well, who is standing on this we, side, 60, our side of the border, border and waiting to get those people who intrude to come in there and then hide them. We so basically you're harboring uh, fugitives. Crossing, uh, in April, December, we had 8,121 just in one month. Wow. One month, 8,121 wow. families crossing the border. Families, families of at least two or amnesty. three. Brandon, I did not give you enough time here. Exactly. Me, so let, are you let, listening let, to me now, Isaac? Go ahead. So these people all or come here and I, expect I, us I to provide them the food, today. shelter, and uh, uh, whatever it takes, medical cost. Those, those individuals that cross under the Obama administration. Now it's it's been much better under the Trump administration, <clears> but you still have those Obama Ninja. holdovers that are Hold forcing over. us to process yeah. the, the illegal aliens that we catch 
and, and set them up so that they can then turn around and release them. And that's got to change. And, and I am well, hopeful who are these it's going to change. Who, yeah, because we who know are that these President people? Trump is tough on immigration. He just has to deal with those <clears> Obama holdovers. Things. And once that happens... Well, let's get yeah, the hold over idiots, like morons, and traitors out. They're not really stupid. They're just... There were four of them. They took up four seats in first class. Young women and young children. They all have on brand new clothes. One bag of all brand new belongings. No identification whatsoever. Flight intended. So we to cut that short, but she went on to say they escort with them. And because she didn't the, know where they ended up ultimately, but this happens time and time again. She's a long time flight visa. attendant. She knew what she was talking about. Enrique, really <clears> quickly, <throat> you can respond. Wow, so that's disgusting. Chris, They're on first class. I can't even get into a fucking first class migrant. without being told this to, to go back. The so you take these what? They're not migrants. Fuck off. I can't believe that. You should change that. These are In true dirt. Trespassers, the very least. Burglars, they, they're robbing us, they're robbing from us, invading us. So if you protect them, you're a traitor, Enrique. You ought to go to jail and be tried for treason because you're waiting on the other side of the border and then you embrace them and tell them this is how you, you, you need to do in order to get our money to pay for your flights and be dispersed and disappear uh, into every city. I can't even drive up to Oxnard, Santa Barbara without being surrounded by all sorts of uh, invaders. Attacking you and your community? This is shocking. Details of immigration policy run amok from the head of an MS-13 gang task force. Up next. Okay, I gotta go.